Einig Boss in deep trouble as Peter Obi's cry has been heard by foreign observers. Unleash action. To me, this action unleashed is not enough. The only thing I think that will satisfy Peter Obi on this error committed, because this error is not committed, it did not affect APC, neither did it affect PDP. Why is it that it affected labor? If there is, if they don't intentionally have a game to play, why? Why? Why is it that it happened to labor? Why didn't it happen to APC? Why didn't it happen to PDP? If they want Peter Obi to accept it as an error. Come on, let's pick up now. We are human beings. We are human beings. This is what Nam the Kanu was saying. That in one way or the other, they will look for a way to disqualify Peter Obi. So what's the essence of you killing yourself on something that you know that they are not going to give to you? Spend that money. Spend that, uh, that idea. Spend that strength in joining the pursuit for Biafran freedom. Look at it. Look at it. They, 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 they are apologizing. Apologizing. It's just apology. Just apology. Is that what he's going to eat? Hey! <laughs> Story don't tire up my people. Let's check the content. This is morning news. The Auditor General of the Labour Party Presidential Campaign Council, Aki Osutokun, has said that his principle is unfazed by the controversy that has surrounded the elections. He made this known to Channels TV in chat on Sunday, February 26th. His position is that he has charged us with the responsibility to, post, to respond and grapple with the situation as it unfolds and that is what we are doing. That is my duty long before the elections. The 2023 election which has been arguably peaceful has been marred with controversy. Pockets of violence we are witnessed in several police units across the Federation. Names of some senatorial and national assembly candidates of the Labour Party we are also missing from the ballot papers. Osutoku, however, said that Einek has apologized for the omission. His position is that he has charged us with the responsibility to respond and grapple with the situation as it unfolds, and that is what we are doing. That is my duty long before the elections. He also warned that the party will compare the INEC results for the presidential elections to the already available figures on the IREV portal. The results from the polling units are already in public custody, polling units by polling units. So we will wait and see what the INEC is going to upload and eat with the results that we have and conclude at the polling unit and see if they tally. They should better tally. Show us now. They should better tally because nobody will accept a belated result like this. Show us now. No, nobody. We had, apart from this lamentation that uh, Peter Obi. Is lamenting. Um, Obasan Chotu lamented, gave his reasons. Um, for, uh, uh, police commissioner cries out uh, uh, and saying that 20 uh, ballot boxes were snatched by 20 talks. Do you see that? So many reasons, many reasons. See, let us not be biased. Let us help the matter. Let us help ourselves and tell ourselves the humble truth. Okay? Okay. Let's hear from you and let's know what your own opinion and your own advice on what has just been taken note of. Okay? Don't forget to leave them below the comment section. Click on the subscription buttons as well. As the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos. Thank you.